Final Cut Pro finally got the first of its bug fix updates. It's a pretty small one, just like we were expecting, but I am very grateful for these fixes. The first thing it does is that it addresses an issue that caused custom overlays to not be visible in the viewer. So in my viewer, if I go up to view, then go down to show custom overlay, we can now select that and now the overlays will show up properly. I know a lot of people were complaining about this one, so I'm so glad to see that that's been fixed. Next, it fixes an issue that caused errors when using send to compressor from a timeline that included magnetic mask effects. So before, people who used magnetic mask were unable to export using compressor because it caused this big red glaring error sign. Very grateful that that's been fixed. It also improves the reliability of the show horizon command. So if you push command shift H in Final Cut Pro 11, it will show your horizon. And you might have noticed that a lot of the time it didn't always activate. Now, if you do Command Shift H at any time, it should pop up without any issue. And last but not least, it improves performance when pressing and holding the H key to scroll the timeline manually. So if you use the H key and then clicked and dragged along the timeline, a lot of the times it would cause some issues in Final Cut Pro, some stuttering and all sorts of performance issues. So I'm glad to see that that has also been fixed. Like I said, it is a pretty minor update and there's no big new features for Final Cut Pro 11, but I am happy to see some of these larger issues finally get fixed so that we can get back to editing. If this video was helpful, consider pressing that like button, consider subscribing, and you definitely need to check out this video where I show you a plugin that absolutely improves the magnetic mask tool in Final Cut Pro 11. Thank you so much for watching, and I cannot wait to see you in the next one.